Hi friends, what's up? This is RK from 360 Reader. Right now, I'm going to show how to change the refresh rate on your MacBook Pro display. Like the Apple Pro Display XDR, Apple's 2021 14-inch and 16-inch MacBook Pro models offer professional-level display performance and customization options. Both the 14-inch and the 16-inch models are the first Macs to feature a liquid retina XDR display which offers higher performance modes and more customization options. For example, it's the only Mac display featuring ProMotion Apple's adaptive refresh rate of 120Hz which is also found on the latest iPhone 13 and iPad Pro models. Thanks to the added customization in macOS, ProMotion isn't the only refresh rate option available to the new MacBook Pro users. You can also adjust it to 60Hz, 59.94Hz, 50Hz or even 48Hz depending on your needs. That all being said, let's learn how to change the refresh rate on your MacBook Pro display. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. To get going, click on the Apple menu located at the top left corner of the screen and select System Preferences. Alternately, you can also load the System Preferences app on your Mac. Then click the Displays icon in the Preferences pane. After that, click the Display Settings button. And if you are using an external monitor, select your MacBook Pro's built-in Liquid Retina XDR display in the side column. Then click the drop-down next to Refresh Rate and choose the desired rate depending on your needs. And if you are only interested in performance, I would recommend you to select ProMotion variable 120Hz refresh rate. It's worth pointing out that there are many built-in tools available in macOS that can be used to further adjust the display settings on your MacBook Pro including resolution, reference modes and brightness. That's all there is to it. So that's how you can change the refresh rate on your MacBook Pro display. Now that you know how it works, make the most of it to enhance your viewing or scrolling experience. If you have found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.